Oh, okay, I'll kill them. Oh, oh. <laughs> Screw this up. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been funny if that's how to play now. But. Okay, you guys reach the top edge of the ravine. It's very wet. It's very cold. It is probably about 30 degrees outside. Are you in bare feet? Yes. Your feet are freezing cold. Um, you reach the top of the ravine. Um, when you hear, uh, and this is like a minute two later, as you're reaching the top of the beam, when, when you can hear what sounds like people rushing up from the temple from down below. Did they all take their boots? No, no, no. Okay. Tarmac's boots got taken, what? They were, they were nice. They were nice boots. They were nice boots. Oh, you had nice boots, that's right. They took your boots, they're like, yeah, I like nice boots, buddy. Yeah, Jordan boots. boots. <laughs> okay. <High top. laughs> where do you, which direction do you want to go? You're out cold. Yeah. I'm just pointing out. Oh, wait, what is, what is, how many directions is it possible? Every right? direction. Oh, gotcha. Any way you want to go. Right now you don't know. Let's go. Do you have navigation? Yeah, I do. Okay, make a navigation check. Try with me. I have direction sense. Then make a direction sense check. See if you can figure out which way is north from where you've come up out of this ravine. Uh, there are. Can figure out which way is north? Yeah, I'll probably. When you were down is here. Uh, but. So yeah, I have to make it. Why do I get a little higher now? You didn't make it? So I have to make my seven. Okay. So I have to make my wisdom plus wisdom one. Plus one, correct. Okay. So uh, 15 or less. Two. A two. You know which way is north. Do you have navigation? Mm, no. You don't. Because you don't care where you're going, you're just going. I'm yeah. not familiar with no, the that's, area. That's, 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 yeah, that's about the journey, not the destination, man. So you're not familiar with this area. You're not sure where you are because you got snatched up. Nothing couple, is familiar. You know which way is north. Which that's, way is that's from a forest? Way. That way. All the way across. That way. <laughs> okay. No, this way is not. Do any of the peasants know where they're going? No. No, they were snatched up, bagged and tagged, and then brought down. Let's so they, they, they were, like, most of them were kidnapped from towns or on caravans and stuff. Are there any like, like roads that we can see, or is it all just like just wilderness? Hills, wilderness hills, broken trees. Uh, it's it's just a broken area. It's dark. It's very cold. Uh, you guys, it's probably closing on 11 p.m. Um, yeah, uh, there are thunderheads in the distance. You can see flashes in the sky, miles and miles and miles away. Um, but they do appear to be coming your direction. The, the clouds that are filled with the thunderheads are heading your way. In a few hours, there might be a thunderstorm again. Nice. I mean, you're talking like way far away. Like the horizon is where you're seeing the, the flashing lights occasionally. You know which way is north. Everyone's looking to you for guidance. Even the half thing's like, where are we going? Pointed okay. you, pointed at you. Didn't you? Or was that earlier? What? Am I mixed up? Maybe I mixed up. Um, not our sponsor. You say not our sponsor? Yeah, it's unfortunately. Come on, Mike. So we've been in there for a while. You don't have a whole lot of time for a conversation. Okay. You need to make a decision because. Are there like, is there any kind of like woods or like areas where can take cover? No. There are broken little bits of trees. Um, even though it's waiting for kind of your yeah. signal, at least on, uh, for as far as a direction. The, the ravine goes this way and north is this way, okay? So if you want to go south, you'd have to go around the ravine. If you want to go, you can go any other cardinal points, pretty much. Going west is going to take you back towards where the orbs are coming up. Does that make sense? Yeah. Going east will take you along the edge of the ravine and away directly away from the orbs. Well, north will take you kind of directly away. Go a northeast north direction, I guess. Northeast? Northeast will direction? Okay. Um, that way. Give me another navigation check. Okay. It's the middle of the night and you're panicking because the orbs are coming. So, did you make it? Okay. Good. What you do know is Neron lies south of the last location that you were in. Okay. So you know that. So you don't know where you are, though. Um, depending upon, they didn't take you very far, but you do know Naran was south of your last location because you came up through Naran, which is a country, yeah. up into the Flinty Hills by going north. Okay. So you do know that, but you don't know where in the Flinty Hills you are. Exactly. That doesn't exactly help me. <laughs> Just giving you some general stuff that you might, you failed your first navigation check, which would have given you more specifics. Yeah. I'm giving you this just to give you kind of general why. Remember this. So, he's starting to lead you guys in a northeast northeasterly direction. That's when you're like, wait a minute. Hmm. But you and that's when now. Uh, what's half your shoulder? Huh? Yeah, Neuron is south, though. South. Oh, north. Or 
The ravines in the way are going due south. Yeah, we'll go due south then. The, the ravines in the way. Oh, wait, Here's the ravine. You guys came out on this side of the ravine. And it's going generally in eastern and western lead direction. So we have to go around the ravine to get... If you want to go south, you'll have to go around the ravine. Which way looks like the shorter way around? Uh, I can't tell. Infravision only still goes about 60, 70 feet in, in this kind of darkness. Um, right now it's going as far as you can see in the direction. And then we go up, kind of like the northeast direction, we can kind of circle around and then... If you want, yeah, you can yeah, that. He's just, do you say that or you just shake your head and just do like this and just No, go. I'll say that. Okay, okay. I'm not just going to... So he's explaining like, what's going on. <laughs> right, no, I'm checking, I'm checking, I'm checking. There's okay. no time to explain. <laughs> okay. Um, I can hunt for the night if I need to. You do have your bow and however many arrows you have left. Oh, um, I have like seven years, so I have really The orcs don't have any tracking and you guys do have a good lead on them, so they're not going to have, they're going to have a hard time seeing you. Um, oh. 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 Okay. Um, you guys said northeast for how long before you want to try to curve around to try to go south? Right now everybody's looking at you, Colin. You bet at least knows which way is north. This guy does the three. This is the original god of travel. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Help us, Colin. You know Help us, Tarmac. I guess maybe for Wait, what time did you say it was getting close to? You guys broke out around uh, 10 30. It hasn't been more than half an hour at the most. 10 30 at night? Yeah. It's dark out here. Maybe. Which might be an advantage. Does he get his spells back at 8 in the morning? morning? Uh, yes, yeah. He kind of prays for his spells in the morning and then he gets some spells. I guess maybe go up a mile or so and then. And then curve? Okay. And then curve. Um, Give a good fly. Curve to the ring. Um, yeah. What? Oh. Um, as you're traveling, you think you hear like like dogs barking somewhere way far back behind the dogs. Or you're gonna keep going. <laughs> okay, just let me know. Are they domesticated creatures? You don't know? We're we talking like four type. They're pretty far back. They might be as far back as the ravine. They might even be like the dwarves. Yeah, I know, that's why I'm like, hey. Okay. Okay, uh, you go for you said an hour. Or mile, no, you said a mile. About you go for about a mile, and then you start curving off towards the southerly direction, trying to get around the ravine. You don't spot the ravine at all by that time anymore. Um, and you start heading south. Uh, it's <laughs> pouring rain. Pouring rain? No, no, sorry, it hasn't started rain. Through the cold and the darkness, um, the other slaves are worn out from carrying him as best they can. There's four of them. There's one on each arm and one on each leg, essentially, like... Your truck, there's mud. There's a lot of mud and stuff because of the rain that just happened. Unbelievably heavy. Yeah, you're super heavy and totally out cold. So you're like freaking dish rat. Which makes you even harder. Yeah. Uh, he needs a day's rest or healing spells actually to wake up. And I have to wait. <laughs> which is uh, terrible. I just needed a one health. I know. If I'd roll a two, you'd be fine. Yeah, no, I'm not. You're fine, fine, but he would at least be mobile. Yeah. Um, Adelian has like ditched. Uh, his spells worn off anyway, but he ditched it as soon as you guys kind of reached the top. Yeah. Um, there's a little ambient light. It's very dark. A lot of people are stumbling and falling on uh, just constantly. Um, so close. Um, you lose track of Arthelion. He gets separated from you guys. Um, oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, you don't care. Um, <laughs> you can still hear barking and dogs occasionally. Um, And you start heading south, how, how long do you want to travel that direction? I think we should make camp at some point. We gotta get really far away before we do yeah. that, because we'll see the light. You can still hear orcs shouts in the distance, really far away, and dogs barking. Mm -hmm. From the same direction. Miles. Do what? We gotta go a few more miles. <laughs> okay, how far do you want to go? How, how long do you want to travel? You can make roughly three miles an hour. Yeah, let's I'm going to say two with the peasants, because a lot of them are weak. Let's travel for about an hour. Let's see what it's... Try to get about two miles away. Okay. Two miles away. Okay. Um, you don't hear the orcs or the dogs after traveling a couple miles. And this is hilly. It's very hilly and rugged. So you're not even sure if you if, if you could be seen. If you could, there's hills. There's little areas of some trees, but not a whole lot. Oh, yeah. 
things that I can't track. Mm. Yeah, maybe we should stop it. Stop and make a small camp at least rest for a few hours. Okay. Before we keep going. Uh, where? Mm. Describe to me where you want to make camp. Well, what is, what is there? You said it's really hilly where we're at. Very hilly. Very rugged and hilly. Like, are we in between a couple of hills? Are we on a hill? Or where do you want to be? I guess maybe kind of on top of one of the hills. Okay. I think there's a beacon that would be kind of fire. We should. Stay in between. I don't think we should. How are we supposed to stay warm? Yeah, it's cold as crap. You can't feel your feet anymore. A lot of the slaves have like their feet wrapped in cloth and crap like that. Or their crappy boots. Yeah, you still have your shoes if you have shoes. Yeah, they took his. his. Yeah, our belly and you don't know what happened to him, so. I can at least make some shitty shoes if I can hunt the beard and skin them. That'd take a really long time. <laughs> that would probably take hours. And you haven't seen any like wild animals. You haven't seen any wild animals. Any gross because it'd stink. Yeah. Well, yeah, it's better hurt. than losing your feet. so bad. <laughs> yeah, let's stay on the point. It's so the cold. Hills. It's uh, it's probably getting under. It's under. It's below freezing now, probably. I'm gonna make a fire though. <laughs> okay, the thunderstorm, whatever it is, is coming closer too. It's uh, it flashes of lightning. We're only gonna be in here for like an hour or so. Okay. Need to stay long. So where? On top of a hill? No, between two of them. Okay, so you you get back down into like a lower area. Uh -huh. uh, fire building. I wanna do you have fire building? Yes. No, make a roll. As people start to collect, slaves start to collect, uh, peasants, yes. which we're going to start calling, start to collect. Do you have anything to start the fire with? I don't I, uh, need it, actually. Do you have flint and steel? Oh, you're good to go. Yeah. Um, they collect, um, they collect a, a bunch of stuff, uh, twigs and crap. And, um, you're going to go hunting? Okay. You can try going hunting. It's cold as crap. Anybody grab your cloak? You're cold as shit. Gotta do okay. what I gotta do. Okay. You're going to go off on your own and hope to find him again. Um, yeah, you managed to get a small fire started. You should be able to what? Track my own footsteps back. Um, possibly. Uh, you get a small fire started. Um, your feet look terrible. Yeah. You're getting a lot of pain. It's a snowy area. Do what? Why is it raining in a snowy area? Uh, because it gets warm enough during the days that it doesn't feel like it. I know. It's not raining right now. Yeah, you said it was in the distance. Yeah. Thunderstorms can happen in the winter. Well, it's happening right now. <laughs> I guess you get to see something uncommon. Weird. All right. <laughs> Weird weather. Magic. The question is, do you? All right. You've made a small fire enough that you can warm your feet up. They hurt worse when they get warmed up. Mm. You just want to put them off. The are like <laughs> exhausted. Um, they put um, they put Leon as close to the fire as is safe. It seems to be. Um, some of them are trying to warm him with their bodies. You know. You're like, oh, Leon. <laughs> Leon. Help Leon. Anyway, you know, anything like that. Um, you're doing what? Uh, All right. Let me find the old hunting rules here. Did they leave me in my armor? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. They're not taking you out of your armor. That's actually some warmth for you. Okay. Good. I mean, I wasn't sure strong. on how we're playing that because if it's like, oh wait, it's not straight up metal. That would have been bad. No, it's split metal. There's gonna be an, there's gonna be an under layer of leather and all this other crap too. It's the same with like plate mail and stuff like that. So it's a very uncomfortable sleeping bag. You're not sleeping very well, no. Uh, I think it's more of just unconscious. <laughs> hunting. Attempt to stalk a great brown. No, it doesn't say how long this will take. Um, Check. Yeah, straight up fish to check, whatever you need. This will get you to within. Why? You failed? Okay. You spook it and he runs off. That's two hours worth. Flips you off as you run. <laughs> uh, yes, make the tracking check. You okay, go Yes. Okay, yeah. you, follow, <laughs> you follow the deer. I find it now. Make me another hunting check. I'm going to see how close you can get. 
Okay. You are 135 yards away. You can attempt to close the range, but for every 20 yards that you try to get closer, you have to make another hunting check. How far am I from it? 135 yards. 135. 135, yeah. I can shoot up to a range of 20. Okay. Pew so. pew! Hold on. We're going to actually, we have a moment. We're not in the middle of combat, so we're going to check and see what these range increments actually mean. Okay, you got this. Mm. Who is? Everybody? Yeah, it's Yeah, it's not very nutritious. Two people died because it sucked. Those poor people. Leon, that'll haunt him to the end of his days. Okay. Yeah, I didn't minus know people two, could die of fatigue. I would have been here. Minus two for medium range. Minus five for long range. Yes. To hit. Yeah, I got so. it actually. Oh, sweet. Okay. So, what we say, 135 yards, yes. and you're at, so right now you're long range, you're 108, 100, 108. So I would need to make... Yeah, minus five to hit. Oh, what? Oh. For your bow. Okay. Or you if you try to close with it, you can make another you hunting check. Out. Every hunting check, if you succeed, you can get yes. another 20 yards closer. Nice. So, that's up to you, how you want to handle this. She's been gone for a couple hours. Uh, your feet are a mess. They're bloody and in bad shape. Um, some of the peasants are giving you some of the their, the cloth from their clothing to try to wrap your feet. This might be them wanting something. You can decide how you want to handle that. Go ahead. What do you want to do? Uh, Thanks, guys. I'm just going to shoot it. Okay. <laughs> just going to shoot? So minus five to hit. Yeah. Two six. It's fun to deer. Wow, yeah. Um, what armor class do you hit? Oh, nice. Oh. Now in this game you want to roll high, yeah. I mean, depending because I'm all low. Yeah, okay. Your, uh, skills and stuff. So I've got fourteen. Here, here, let's see. Oh, hurting. Great. I know some stats for animals like that here. Minus five. That would be a fourteen. Which is armor class. Oh, sorry, six. There you go. Thank you. That's a hit. Um, how many hit dice? We'll give it six. Yeah. We'll do a light. We'll do the equivalent of a light force. So. Okay. That's how many hit points he's got. You hit him. Roll me damage. Two. Okay. Wish. <laughs> the deer exploded. <laughs> yes, the deer runs away. It runs off. You have to do another tracking check to follow him in the dark. What did you get a bonus? Because yeah, of the blood? Uh, I would get a plus one bonus too. Uh, and you need a hunting check to get close again. Yes. Okay. This time you're 167 yards away. That's still long range. But it's still within range of your short bow. Yeah, it's good. Fire again. Yeah. Okay. Okay, you miss. Um, Shot straight up in the air. <laughs> really? It doesn't, it doesn't spook. Roll a one, a two. Okay. No, no, I rolled a three. Uh, but that's negative two from the minus. Roll me a 20 sided die. Tell me what you get. A five. You spooked him, he's off again. I got it. Fucking Gertie's just died. Weed out. <laughs> Got an arrow stuck in him. Yeah, he does. Poor thing. Okay, you're gonna I'm keep chasing. You're gonna keep yeah. track of him. We're in mostly real time right now, so this is going pretty quickly after that initial two hours. Um, <laughs> two days later, she comes back with the deer. Here's your goddamn deer. If you guys are gone, you guys are only gonna be there for Where do they go? Well, I don't know. I'm assuming they're waiting for you at this point. Yeah, so, um, oh, go ahead and make, me, make me another tra <laughs> tracking yeah. check. I'm looking at how the bad yeah. peasants were doing. Maybe another uh, hunting check <laughs> to see if you can get within range. Oh, yeah. People are dying. 153 yards. 153. Yep. All right, let's shoot. Okay. <laughs> Just fuck it. Another miss? No, it's 14 minus 5 is a 9. So, 11. 11 is a miss. Is 
Yes. Um, and we're going to do 20 rolls. We'll see if you spook him. Okay, he's not, he didn't notice. You fired so far away from him. He's like, 153 oh, yards. Look at the in the stuff. Are, you marking, <laughs> are you marking off your, your freaking arrows? Oh, I used like two. You used three. three so far with this yeah. hunt. Not to mention the ones you fired at the orchard before that. So. Should have grabbed up an orc. Oh, wait, I got to cut his boots off of it. Yeah, sorry. Okay, okay so what do you want to do? Do you want to try to get closer or are you going to shoot this guy? Okay, I need another hunting check. Yeah. Yes. Okay, that puts you at 133 yards. Is that within medium range yet? Yeah. 100 yards. Okay, what are you doing? Shoot or try to get closer. Wait, this fish was used to Try to get closer. Okay, make a hunting check. Yes. You made it? Yeah. You were at 113 yards. And you're 20 yards closer for <laughs> Oh, fuck. You failed? Okay, he, he bolts. He's gone. Oh, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> I hate this. I fucking hate this game already. Don't hate this game. Yeah, I fucking hate it already. You're hunting. It's a long, drawn-out process. Trap again. Okay. Nope. Oh, you've lost his trap. You have no idea where he went. What do I do at this point? Well, it's closing on 3 a.m. and snow starts coming 3 down. 3 a.m.? Yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> it was midnight when they made camp. You went to, took you two hours to, to track this guy the first time. Yeah. He keeps bolting, and then you have to chase Can him I down. Can track for like any other animal then? Uh, you don't. Uh, mm, sure, maybe a track check. Ooh, yeah. What should I throw against? It? What terrible monsters? I mean, if we see his footprint, I'm gonna know what the fuck's gonna be a deer or not. If I see big fucking footprints. I don't think I want to go after a bear. Be sad, Tom. Mm. No, no, She'll come back again someday. Here we go. 241. <laughs> Do you have survival? No. Switch. No. 
Not unless you make yourself a fire and try to work, get out the night. Oh, you're right. All my shit is back in the fucking No, don't, no. Don't even, don't even. You're the guys that left without all your gear. And you're the one that went off hunting when you weren't sure if you can find your way back. I'll give you one more navigation check. See if you can find your way back before dawn. If nothing's changed. Are you still, well, what are you going to do? Are you going to keep trying to find your way home? Or what are you going to do? Tell me what you're going to do and I'll tell you what happens. I'm going to try to go home. Go back to the camp. Okay, but you made your second navigation check and you failed it, right? Okay. You're getting colder and colder and you lost. Yeah. What do you want to do? Okay. Um, you take a point of damage. That's pretty cold. Uh, that's another hour. Uh, the snow is coming down harder now. Say what? Well, then you better hunker down somewhere and try to stay warm instead of just wandering around. Walking. Yes, there is. Yes, there is. You're not trying at all. You can find a, you can find shelter in the trees somewhere. You can find anything that you cover you up with. These are these are pine trees. It's a, it's hills. It's rugged lands. What I'm saying is, there's always stuff you can do, or you can just get mad and give up. I mean, that's your choice. I mean, but you got lost because you went hunting. How to go about, like, getting lost the snow. Right. So, what do you want to try to do? I think I'm just talking about that. Okay. Well, wait. What does that mean? Find something to keep me warm or like, whatever. I don't think these are going to keep me warm. They'll keep you warmer than walking around out in the wilderness, Will. Yeah, they will. Okay, I'm saying this as a GM. They will, period. Okay? <laughs> You're I'm making a goddamn call here. I wouldn't do it because I'm You're getting salty and you've decided to stop trying. Because it was lost. There's nothing I can do. It's right. frustrating. I understand, but you can either let it frustrate you and piss you off, or you can still try to fight your way and survive. Instead of you getting frustrated with me. I'm frustrated because you've given up. If you give up, yeah, your character's going to just wander around until she drops dead of frostbite. Am I clouded by the tree? I don't really know what's there. Okay, you could hunker down. You could use pine leaves to try to cover yourself up as best you can. You can, um, yeah, grab anything. You can dig a little hole and cram yourself into it next to a tree and try to stay warm as you possibly can. You could try to get a fire lit. start a fire lit? You're a ranger. It doesn't mean I have survival well, or anything. All I'm saying is. You can still try to survive. If you just keep wandering around looking well, when I'm you're lost. I'm just gonna go find some trees. Okay. You find some trees <coughs> that are close together that will give you some shelter from the wind and the cold. You might survive till morning. I'm gonna clear snow, so it's not that cold. Okay. There you go. All That's right. something. What are you guys doing? Uh. We've got a nice fire. She can go off for like four or five hours. Have we heard any like dogs or orcs or? No, anything? no, you haven't heard anything. We've gone several miles. I guess just stay. I guess just wait. Okay. Just wait out. Dawn way. starts to peek its head up above the hills to your east. Um, it's still coming down pretty strong as far. Oh, the snow is. The snow has lightened up a lot. Uh, you got about an inch for in an hour. Uh, oh no, and then it stopped. So. Um, Get my spells back. It's around 6 a.m. You can get your spells back. Healing. And I'm healing the half-flying and the paladin. <laughs> okay, roll for them. Or, oh yeah, I've got a, Okay, for the paladin. Six. Yay! That's very good. Okay. Three of the villagers have succumbed to the gold and died in the night. That sucks. That's a fire. Yep, well, they were already oh, weakened. Yeah. Um, you at least had Hi. your health. Did you know any mean? of the ones that I'm talking about me die? No. Good. Your body heat actually kept them warmer. than the, And you're right next to the fire. Nice. Uh, which they have been, it's actually some of them who have been trying to keep the fire going. Um, one of them came and laid down by the fire, and then you found him dead the next morning. Uh, another one uh, didn't ever come back from going to get sticks. Um, awesome. And the third one... Um, came back and um, sat there by the fire and just watched it and then he realized he wasn't looking at anything. These people had rough for the last potentially months. There's no sign of the elf. And it does look like it might start snowing again soon. 
Do, you, do we know what direction Great. she had us? Uh, yeah, she went that way. <laughs> I mean, you saw her okay. leave. She's like, I'm going to make some food, and she just took off. Which, which direction do I know that she went? She went in uh, an easterly direction from you guys. I guess we can go that way. <laughs> okay. It's very cold, but it's warming up with the day coming up. It's starting yeah. to actually start to warm up a little bit as the sun rises. Um, Caitlin, make me a constitution check. Constitution or less than a D20. Out of six. Out of? Fourteen. Fourteen, okay. You Four. wake up uh, the next morning. You have survived the night. Cool. You're very, <laughs> very fucking cold. Probably. You're very stiff because <laughs> you pulled yourself into like a ball and covered yourself as best you could. And, um, yes? Oh, no, no, no. I thought you were going to say something. Okay, okay. What do you want to do? Um, it's warming up, the sun is up, and I it's starting to warm up a little now. bit. Yes, you can see from potentially any, miles like, if you get on the top of a. Uh, oh, yeah, with Maybe a perception check. This is to determine if you're close enough to actually see it. Yes. Uh, yeah. I it follow is. Follow that and go back. <laughs> Thank goodness we didn't have to make decisions. Because I think my paladin would have just took the peasants to safety. You, it's about four miles. Uh, and actually, you run into them coming towards you. Okay. Uh, she looks terrible. I'm going to sure. kill How many? Oh, okay, there you go. Yeah, I have three hit points out of ten. Yeah. Okay, you cast a killing spell on her? Two. <laughs> so you're fine. Yeah, hey, I'm healthy. It's better than it was. Yeah, it's okay, it's terribly cold. Like, and now I'm out of spells again. What's <laughs> <laughs> a day? Yeah. Okay. Uh, it's very cold, it but it's like warming me. up. Are any of the peasants looking like they're going to kill over? Oh, that's a good question. Oh, yeah, yes. I kind of want to fix No, them. actually, they they appear to be right now, the ones that are left are like the most sturdy of them, even though they're still like underfed, malnourished, in terrible shape. Yeah. So did the only yeah, child die the first probably, night? Probably, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, no, there's still, there's a couple other kids, but they're older, they're like 13 or 14, so they're pretty much considered adults. Oh, what do we do with the body that died? They, they haul 